Hello everybody and welcome back to your 11th HTML tutorial. Uh, I hope that's the right number, I've actually forgotten. But um, last time we were working on our inputs here and they're going very nicely. And uh, you can see if we check these boxes that they work nicely, that's what we worked on last time. And our inputs are looking nice. Now, there's still a lot of work to do on inputs, but it's getting a little bit boring in my opinion. And I know if you learn lots of one thing, you know, one type of thing at once, it can be a bit confusing uh, or even just a bit boring. So today we're going to be looking at page one and we're actually going to just add in a video, uh, which I think is a little bit more exciting. So if we come into our uh, website here and come to index, which is our first page, uh, we are just going to add in a comment here that just says uh, below is a video, blah, 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 blah. And we'll just start with our video tag. Now, 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 now. Um, we can actually just slash here. So what we're going to do is say source equals, and this is the source to our video. So if I come in here, uh, I've just put it in alongside, same as my image. But remember, if we're going to have it in a different folder, uh, then we just have to update it. So just remember that. So We'll put in a new folder just to show it off, and we'll call this uh, folder videos. And so now what we're going to say is from our index.html, we need to go into videos in order to find the video. So video slash, and then my video is just called video.mp4. Uh, at least I believe it's an mp4. Let's have a look. Yep, .mp4. Fantastic. So um, that should work by itself. Uh, is it going to work? Ah. Yep, so it works. Fantastic. Now there's a few things. First of all, you can see I actually had to enable show all controls. Now that's not ideal. So to fix this, we're just going to add in controls and I believe that should be it. So we reload. Now you can see the controls are automatically there, which is very nice. And then there's a couple of other things we can do. We can also say if we want uh, autoplay. And so now if we load it up, it should just automatically, no. It's not going to autoplay. Hmm. Okay, autoplay is not working for me. Um, what other ones do we have? We've got muted, I believe. It should be muted. Yeah, you can see muted is working. Uh, we've got loop. So if we were to play and get to the end. And it goes back to the start. Cool. Uh, so I'm not sure why autoplay is not working. It should be. Oh, it is working. There we are. Maybe I typed it wrong before. So we've got autoplay. Uh, what else do we have? We also have a poster, I believe. And this is the image that when we load the page, you can see if I get with autoplay. You can see we've got this nice little image here before we play the video. And if we want to change that to, say, the Rick Astley image, uh, we can just add that in there. And if we get rid of autoplay, you can see our video image is now Rick Astley, and we hit play. So yeah, um, that's pretty much the basics of the video tag. Uh, it's all quite nice, and um, yeah, I, I think it's good, and uh, we'll just make it a bit more tidy, maybe add a line. Oh, there is one other thing that's very important. Actually, I forgot to mention. You can see this is way too big for us. So if we wanted to, we could just change the width. So we could make it 200 pixels. And we can also change uh, the height. But uh, there's not much point in changing the height because it scales uh, with the width. So normally you just change the width and we'll make it uh, What's our image? 25%. Sounds good to me. So there you are. We've got our nice little video here. It auto plays. It's on mute. We 
can unmute it. We've got all our controls. And uh, yeah, so that's the basics. That's the tutorial for today. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed it. And uh, if you did, subscribe, leave a comment down below if you've got any questions. Uh, like the video, do all that fun stuff. And uh, yeah, thanks for staying tuned. And uh, I'll see you next time. See ya.